All right. Let me explain to you why you should not coat a metal roof with uh, acrylic paint or silicone. But acrylic is the worst. I'm going to try to explain this and I'm going to tell you how we fix it. But the first thing is why you should not coat it. Let me show you. If you look at the acrylic, the, the coating they put on here, it's a huge roof. And from day one, they had this problem from day one. Now, first problem is, let me show you. Water condensates at the top of this building. You see how it's a slanted roof, quite slanted. And water condensates in the inside. And then it flows between these two panels where the seams are. And then it accumulates right here because this, there was a, a coating here that blocked the water. So first of all, you want to get condensation to be able to, that's trapped there, to be able to escape. And if you cannot get it escape, it's going to rust this. This is what happens. You see the rust? The, se the next thing is these fasteners. They will cause leaks. I'm going to show you how. Watch. So we haven't treated this one yet. So look at this. Where is it? Right here. I think this one. Let me see. The fasteners, what happens is, if, if this coating comes loose for some reason, water gets underneath there. You can see there. Right. Look. See that? The water gets underneath there. And it will flow all the way down towards the fastener. Right here. See? Alright, so this is all open here. Look at it. It's wet. See there? It's wet. So, the water would flow down underneath the, the coating right to this fastener and then it gets blocked here. It, it pulls around this fastener and wherever it pulls it will rust. It rusts this, the fastener. There's a lot of places rusted. Look at it. See that? Rusted. I already, we already cleaned a lot of it but the fasteners will rust because of the coating allowing the water to, to, to accumulate uh, underneath the um, uh, underneath the coating, it, it water accumulates around the fastener, the screw, and then you have a leak. This is seven. There's two reasons why you should not coat it. The only reason you coat a metal roof is if it's so rusted and you want to protect it from uh, not rusting anymore. But then, don't uh, don't close the, uh, the the seams. Don't close these seams. If you're gonna if you're gonna coat it, don't close these seams up. Keep the seams open. So look at this. We open the seams here at the bottom. And uh, you, this will cost three, two, three hundred thousand dollars to replace this roof. So for thirty, forty thousand dollars, we're making a repair but it could have been prevented from the beginning. It's much faster, easier to coat around the fasteners and make the necessary repairs than trying to remove all the stuff. All right, that's why you should not coat a metal roof. All right, so to fix the problem, you have to clean every fastener and tighten it up and coat it with a sealer and then you'll be okay. Let me show you. So first thing we do is we remove the silicone and the caulking, whatever's around the fastener. And we use a torch to, to soften it up. If we don't know which fastener is uh, rusted or not, you can see this one's rusted. And uh, we remove it like this. Heat it up with a torch like that. job. There you go. It's clean. Now, after you remove it, then you use your little grinder and you clean up. <clears throat> I use a grinder 
Milwaukee, I like Milwaukee the best. I got like five batteries on a charger and I keep having it. Look at the cone brush. See this brush? Okay, so very important. Every screw like that. Look at the rust here. Come here. Look at the rust. So, you want to remove all the rust, right? Look at the hole. There's a hole there from all the rust. There's a little hole there. Okay. There's a hole. So it's leaking inside the building. You know, many of these has these holes where a rust has gone through already and you got to patch it. I want to show you what I will patch it with. I got a special product, uh, it's called a uh, silicone patch and I'll, I'll put it over that and then you won't have to worry about it. It's very easy. Let me show you. So, the, the, uh, the screws is holding the metal roof down. The water accumulates around those screws when you have this uh, coated with any acrylic paint or latex or whatever you have or even silicone. When it accumulates, it rusts through like you see here. It's rusted through. You can see the insulation there. So what I do is I clean this with a wire brush and then to make, to make it easy, I patch it before I put a, a sealer over it. So I patch it with silicone patch. Let me show you. I use a polyester fleece, specially made for that, and I put it right over that, like that. Let me show you how I do it. I use the patch, it's very thick. I mean, you can see this is not, look at it, very thick. So, I use a patch right over there, just like that. And then, I add my fleece over that. All right, and then I'm, I'm done. This is how you patch a metal, any hole in a metal roof. You can do it with patch, silicon patch. Make sure you cover the, the fleece, the polyester fleece, because the sun will, it will not last in the sun. Look, and that will never go bad again, never. Patch is done, and I used a silicon patch, and that's the best. That's the, that's really the only way to go. All right, and that's what I do. I patched a a metal roof with holes in it with a silicon patch. All right, six days of brutal, brutal preparation. We prepared every. Uh, what do you call it? Fastener or screw. They were rusted and we grinded, it, cleaned it. And then I want to tell you what I found. Super silicone seal is a much better product. This one, let me see, show you this one. Can okay, see that? Oh, it is a can. Super silicone seal. I like it because it really really seals well check this out it's really 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 nice it it, it sticks to the neoprene washer underneath the, the screw but also sticks to the metal it's a really really good product i really think instead of turbo poly seal you should use this one to dab every screw after you prepped it. Let me show you, very fast. This is very fast. I'm gonna do a few of them. Let me show you. Whee! Everything wants to slide down here. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. So it's very simple. You just dab your brush, dab it like that and you're done. But this is after you grinded it and cleaned it, done. 
but you look at it just like that done beautiful done that's how you do it 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 prevents rust at the same time and it seals it's not just for sealing it's preventing the rust if so you use the grinder you obviously do get some of the paint off the metal so that's it I'm done really really that it works so nice and you just dab it and you brush it on dab it brush it on and yeah, but if you don't fall off all right that's why you should not coat a metal roof I'm the flat roof doctor I know a thing or two because I've seen a thing or two blah 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 thumbs up please for that girl and subscribe for that one <laughs>